Yeah, because uh, they, I just they definitely burped and it went through my nose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my eyes are watered. <sighs> okay. What's up, everybody? I'm Big Mike. And I'm Brando. And I'm Clint. And this is Brew Hedge. You're damn right. And today we got an interesting one, one from uh, above the border. This is, uh, well, it's Collective Arts, right? Yep. That's the uh, name of the brewery. Uh, this is Liquid Art Fest IPA, ale brewed with mango, passion fruit, vanilla, and lactose. One pint, 5.9% horsepower. Oh, yeah. Um, LiquidArtBrewFest.com, June 15th through the 16th, 2018. On um, this one, we didn't make it. No. <laughs> no. One person has a passport. Yeah. Just waiting on the other two. Yeah. It's coming soon. This is uh, imported by Collective Arts Stowe, Vermont. Product of Canada. That's right. North of the border, baby. Our nice. northern brothers. Collective Arts Brewing, Hamilton, Ontario, Canada. So, uh, first beer from uh, up top there. Yeah. Check this out. Awesome artwork. Yeah, the artwork's pretty cool. Yeah, it's absolutely interesting. Uh, Loch Ness, Bristol, UK. Yep. Uh, see the series at collectiveartsbrewing.com. Unique. Yeah, when you see the can, you yeah, just want to grab gotta it. Grab yeah, it. you got to grab it. It kind of looks like uh, plankton up there. It does. <laughs> All right, let's crack it. Make sure you like, subscribe, follow us on all social media outlets, the Instagrams, the Twitters, the Facebook, the Uncaps, the Reddits. Oh, yeah. Had this beer before? Let us know in the comments below. What we got here? Orange juice. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's like that's. Yeah. Just well, barely like, see it. See through it. I don't see through mine at all. Dude. Yeah, well, it's, it's probably yeah, it's a lot yeah. more. You got more. Yeah, that's dirty. <laughs> yeah, that's dirty. That's a dirty beer, baby. I can't even see a shadow if I no. put my fingers on the other side. Nope. Nope. Color's I'm, pretty. I'm much. actually excited. This, I like this. I love this. Is probably my favorite block. Yeah. Nice, dirty, dirty, hazy, dirty. orange juice look. I, I love it. I love it. I get excited. What do we got for a smell? Smell all that fruit juiciness. Yep. Yeah. I, I smell oh, yeah. a little bit of mango. Yeah, yeah. no, it's got the it's got the hint of mango. I don't know if I've ever like cracked a passion fruit. Yeah, that's yeah, the, I, yeah, I, yeah, I, that's I the one thing I've never really done. I've yeah. never, yeah. I don't know what the actual smell of a passion fruit is. I'm guessing it smells fruit. I'm thinking we got an episode. Maybe right? passion too. Yeah. Get some, get some of the fruits. fruits. And yeah. Just be like, no. <laughs> <laughs> this ain't happening. <laughs> Ready? All right, let's, All right, give, right, a let's a give it a ship. Say give it a ship. <laughs> give it a ship. A ship. Wow. 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 That is interesting, to say the least. Something happening on the back of the yep. tongue. I'm not yep. a fan of. Not, not that I'm not a fan of it's it, it's uh it's letting me know it's there. It's a very unique feeling. Yeah. Like right, like those two like right there at the that part that part of the tongue right yep. there is what I'm talking about. Woo! The things at the top of the fold. Yeah, exactly. Is that you little, getting it too? I got, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's got a like a a bitter twang to it. Twang actually, I, I, it almost has that like the way my tongue reacted was almost like a sour or tart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But it, there's no sourness or tartness I feel like to it. But like it tastes a little sour. Almost but like there's no puckers. There's nothing. Almost like a unripe orange juice. Okay. You no, know, it has that kind of like bittery, you know, flavor to it a little bit. I was expecting a little sip. A little acidicness, but I'm thinking the lactose is probably the lactose is probably, it down. Yeah, taking it down. I, I feel like without the lactose, this would be a very acidic drink. But you know what the funny thing is? I would want to try this without lactose. Oh, that makes one of us. I think the lactose makes it too juicy. It is very juicy. It's very juicy. It, it, yeah. Would you say juice punch? No, juice, juice atomic bomb. Yeah. I feel like I'll go with that. absolutely way juicier beers than this. Oh, this is no. real. Yo, Jerry Nazario's number one. Oh. No, no, but that was, you know what? Dude, by the way, bro, where you been at? Yo, for real. Where you been? 
But uh, that one had more, like, New England juice. Yeah, more beer flavor yeah, to it. Yeah, you're right. You know, it was very. If you gave this to someone who wasn't, who didn't like beer, I don't know if they would realize it wasn't a beer and not like a mimosa. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, you're right. I'm with you on that. Okay. Fucking high five, man. <laughs> that was good. Not bad. A mimosa. I like that. That's <laughs> pretty fucking accurate, actually. I mean, that's that's pretty much where this is. All right, Mike. What do you got for a rating? Um, for me, this is a three. It's like I said. If I would love to have the same everything minus the lactose, because. I think the lactose sweetens it too much, and it takes away from the beer aspect of it. Very sweet. And that's that's me saying, coming from a person who likes sweet shit, I think it makes it just a little too sweet. All right, all right. Fred, what do you got? I'm going to go with a 275. Um, this is a little too juicy for my taste. Um, it is very cool and very unique uh, the flavor it's just too much juice not enough beer juice type flavor not enough beer um, but love the smell love the can very unique and different flavor good inventiveness keep going guys this is really cool Clint, it, what you got it definitely makes me want to try out a next one yeah yeah I mean this is an absolutely you know, and we don't say it on every video. I like to think that when we say, when we tell you guys you should try this, like... This is one you need to see yeah, your opinion on this. This is, this is one of those beers that when you drink, you're like, all right, let me see what else we got. You know, there's a lot of flavors in there that you can't really describe. Oh, yeah. No, this, this is an explosion of juice in your mouth. Um, man, I, I'm like... I'm going to go three and a half. Yeah. Three, seven, five. Because I do like it. I do like it. I, I... We just had a scotch more APB. We're not talking about the disappointment of it. <laughs> it's great. This is a good beer. Like I said, that little bit, I don't get it after the initial sip, the way my tongue reacted. You know, just that thing. Uh, I don't know. I liked it. Yeah. Yeah, that was great. That was it. 375. 375. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely something that, it, like I said, I think Mimosa probably just sums it up quite sums well. Sums it up really, you know, it's got that juicy, sweet, and it's... I'd say I think so, the lack of lactose in it that you were calling for, mm -hmm. I just, I think at that point it wouldn't be tolerable for me because of the acidic thing. Very true. It might be more acidic because there's less, you know, yeah. less sugars in there. There, there's the lactose isn't you shall not pass <laughs> all right i'm just saying i think that's what the lactose is doing for the the uh the city so in this case stomping it down yeah you know, i think it's beating the shit out because <laughs> you can as soon as it hits your tongue your tongue's like oh you almost got me almost got me <laughs> but nah I think we're good here. I think we're good. I I definitely will pick up more more of theirs too. Yeah. Because uh, it's uh, got a little meat going on. Yeah. The flavors are good. It's just I I would just like a little bit more beer. I, you know, honestly, I would eat that. I would have that with breakfast. Like, like it's it's like a mimosa. <laughs> Anyone says we um, orange juice? It's orange juice. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah that. This, this is some kind of fruit juice. Yeah. Normally, people don't drink that size glass of orange juice. <laughs> I do. <laughs> 16 ounce glasses yep. of orange juice. Orange juice comes in pints. Yeah. For real. Ooh. I actually, candle. I would do a candle with this too. The smell, yeah. yeah. The it's, smell it's, of it is really, really good. Yeah. yeah. Mm. The only thing I don't really get, I don't get a lot of vanilla. No. No, I'm waiting on that. Oh, yeah. Excuse me. I forgot that was even in there, to be honest with you. I don't no. get a lot of vanilla, which is... I get the lactose. I, I think it I think it might just be because of the lactose. It kind of, like, maybe takes like, away from the... Because usually vanilla is very, very pronounced. Yeah. Right. Especially in aroma, it's very yeah. pronounced. But you don't you don't taste it or smell vanilla. At least we don't. 
that's our thoughts on this bad boy. Definitely check it out for yourself. Um, yeah, so obviously, yep. you're going to see it. You know you're going to see that can. Yeah, for real. Um, make so, sure you uh, uh, subscribe. Yep. Hit make that sure. notification, baby. And uh, as always, drink responsibly. Stay wildly. Catch you on the next one.